Hello everyone, JRDL96 here with a brand new reaction. As you can tell by the title, it's another Markiplier video, it's another animation, and it's for Go My Favorite Sports Team. It's been actually a very while, long while since the last Go My Favorite Sports Team animation that I've seen. I think the last one I saw was the two boys, one ball, if I'm not mistaken. You know, when they were talking about basketball and, you know, the funny part when he's like, I'm going to... Give birth to my new kid in this, in this locker room so everyone get out. <laughs> Don't look at me. Don't look. <laughs> That's, I believe, what was the last animation related to Go My Favorite Sports Team. I might be wrong. But this one intrigues me since it's called You Didn't Pay the Cheese Tax. I wonder what that entails since, you know, it, you know the, the opening, it seems like it's taking place from the Go My Favorite Sports Team Theater. For one night only, Markiplier's directorial debut. <laughs> Tyler being the pe as a peasant boy or something like that? I have no idea. But I might as well just get right into it and see what this is all about. What does the ch paying the cheese tax mean? So let's find out. So what up with a uh, duh? Let's react to this video, shall we? Oh my god. Tyler. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think cheese racing is? All right, cheese racing. <laughs> what do you think, cheese racing? I think, so when I think of cheese racing, I think you take uh -huh. a, a thing of cheese, which I imagine is and a you wheel. you roll it down a hill. comes in wheels and historically has been that way. Um, and you roll you it down a hill. roll it and run down the hill with it, and you have to both the cheese and you cross the finish line. Okay, fascinating idea. Completely wrong. So silly. All, All right. right. Close your eyes. All right. You... A starving medieval peasant. I'm very hungry. And oh, so hungry. But you love your lord. On the streets. You're my lord. English, English oh. peasant. He gives me a piece of copper every once English in a while. English so peasant! I... Oh. British. My lord. Give me a piece of copper. So <laughs> my family. Peasant. Peasant. I'm a poor peasant. You wouldn't speak that nice if you were a peasant. I'm a poor peasant. <laughs> oh my god. I said, I said, poor, not, not disease. <laughs> <laughs> uh, please, I want food. Boy, gov. Boy, oh, gov. Do not give me the food. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you see in front of you a wheel of cheese, right? I steal it. I'm just grabbing it and running. Hold on, hold on. Okay, uh, all right, that's good. You said I'm starting it. Yeah, yeah, okay, you steal it and run. Okay, you run up, there's a hill in front of you. You're running up the hill. But the sheriff is after you. I just stole the cheese. Come back here, you filthy disease peasant. No, if I come back here, you, you'll just kill me. I'm gonna, my cheese. What? Part of England is he from? All alone, I'm weird. from the poor part that the part that doesn't get food. <laughs> so you run up to this hill. Your name is Cooper, right? All right. Run up to <laughs> all names. Hill. Okay. It's a steep hill near. Gloucester. What? what? Excuse me. Say it again. Say it again. Gloucester. 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 So you right, run up right. this hill, and they're about to catch you. But you know the law back in front because you aren't dumb. You know I'm just poor. You know <laughs> that if you are in possession of the cheese at the time of capture, then you are liable for the crime. You are being illegal. But, thinking quickly, you realize you're on a hill. And if you get the cheese a minimum of 100 yards away from you, which is what the law dictates and what that cheese has to be away from you for you not it be impossible to get the crime, you see an opportunity. Because you know that this hill that you're on is exactly the slope. The hypotenuse of the slope is exactly 101 yards away. You see that the sheriff is behind you. He's a portly fellow. He's huffing and puffing. And you have only a certain amount of time to get it down. So you, thinking quickly, hurl the cheese as fast as you can down the hill. And it makes it just as the sheriff. Oh, oh, hey, where's that you stop right there? And you're like, where? I, I, I don't know. I don't think that's how it works. Because I don't have any chase. Oh God! Oh so God! What are you talking? Really? Where are you, you talking? Where are you talking? Oh well, you're gonna slap me in irons, I guess. <laughs> but you know, 
I ain't got no cheese on me. You talk smooth, do you? <laughs> <laughs> How did cheese get all the way to the bottom of the hill? This I think true. a bird might have grabbed it. Then it wouldn't it be up in the air? Uh, it seems like it was a bit, pretty big, heavy wheel of cheese, so the bird must have lost control of it and dropped it down the hill. You rolled that cheese, didn't you? <laughs> Come on, look at me. Do I look like that? <laughs> be able to roll cheese. Damn, you caught me. <laughs> and that is cheese roll. Oh my lord. Jesus Christ. What the fuck was that? Pay the cheese tax. It has nothing to do with it. All you do is... Like, I've heard of this kind of an event. This kind of a, like, I guess, sport or whatever you want to call it. Where you roll a, a roll of, like, a round piece of cheese. You roll it down the hill and you have to go past it with it at the finish line. I've heard of this and I've seen people freaking tumble around like a tumbleweed on their, on their way down. I don't know why it's a, still a sport, but... I find it interesting. Yeah, I've heard of the sport before, so I've heard of this kind of a uh, thing before, so this is not new to me. Ugh, Jesus. What the fuck? Especially the part when you see, you know, Tyler, you know, you know, flash the guard, you know, the the swordsman. Like really? <laughs> really? Do we really need to see that? Do we need to see his dangly bits? Everything that he's packing there? <laughs> I don't know. But it's just... Mark is the director of this story. And he's like, No, you're a poor medieval peasant. <laughs> and then obviously you have the guard, you know... Wait, why is that block of cheese rolling down the hill? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> so stupid. Really, really stupid. You didn't pay the cheese tax. Like, I could just picture Warstash join, coming in, coming into this going, Where's that roll of, roll of cheese? I haven't seen it. I've just seen it roll down the hill by itself. It was... It, I didn't even touch it. It just went on by itself. Like, oh, this is my place, bitch. And it just rolled down the hill. <laughs> I have no idea, but... That was good. I, I, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed the quality of it. And some of them was pretty funny when Tyler was trying to play off as a poor peasant or whatever. An English, meaning British, British, you know, you know, that kind of thing. So I just found that really amusing. So, uh... Well, it seems like Mark might be back. I don't know. He did randomly stream a few days ago just telling people that someone's trying to murder him when in reality it was all clickbait. All, all it was about was really an at-home appointment he had and then the random doctor goes, that we are doing this for your life insurance policy where according to him, he didn't order one. And then he just ran into this diatribe of randomness about the strike, you know, because of the fact that now the Screen Actors Guild and the Writers Guild are all on strike for the first time in 60 years, both of them simultaneously are on strike, meaning that a lot of movies, TV shows that are currently filming right now, like for example, Deadpool 3, has been halted. Everything has been halted, which sucks. But apparently Mark is a part of the Screen Actors Guild. Which is interesting, apparently because he works for Screen Actors Guild Productions, something like that. But I, according to him, it doesn't really affect him editing the movie. So, because he, he, according to him, he made this, he financed it, and everything. So this was just him. It wasn't Hollywood, but I don't know. Very interesting. <laughs> but I enjoyed the animation. I thought it was really good. It was hilarious. And also... Oh, soon we're expecting another Iron Lung trailer at some point. Don't know when exactly, but hopefully soon. And also recently, Mark kind of, you know, read one of my comments in the chat where, you know, that recent stream he did recently, and I just randomly just said, you know, not necessarily asked him, but wanted to see what his, if he knew, was aware of it, the Dark of Our YouTube figure. And he was like, yes, uh... Yes, there is a darker part of YouTube's figure coming out. And then he just goes, Did you just guess that? <laughs> and I'm like, No. I'm just thinking to myself, No. Like, 
it's been teased by YouTube's Twitter and TikTok accounts. We all know this, but I was wondering if he had any idea what the hell was going on with that. I guess I didn't really get the answer, but it was funny just to see what his reaction, him reading my comment like that was. That was kind of funny. I just found it amusing. Did you just guess that? <laughs> just the, did you just guess that? <laughs> I just found that amusing. But uh, anyways, that's really it on this reaction. We do have two videos from Ethan that he just uploaded recently that we need to check out, including one of them involving that sweet dreaded ASMR. Oh boy. And then there's also the Zillow houses. Like we've seen all the other ones where they're like the best ones. Now we're going to see, I guess, the worst. I guess. I have no idea. But, anyways, that's really it on this reaction. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe, share this video with your friends. Be sure to ring that bell to be part of the vacation squad. Be sure to check out my Instagram because I make Colette's and Markiplier, Jack Septiguy, and myself. I also act as the cosplays on there, so go check it out. And be sure to check out my Tumblr and my Discord in the description as well. So until next time, JRD96 signing out, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace!